Good morning, sunshines. Good morning. Welcome to your next social study class. And today's goal, goal, we're going to change the goal already. <laughs> and today's goal will be describing the beginning of the colonial age. So we were working on the roles, right? Remember, we had the Blanco Chapetón, who was from Spain. We had the Blanco Criollo, who was born here not from Spain, but his parents were. And, well, what happened is that this Blanco Chapeton was creating alliances, right? So he was like, okay, I'm going to be in charge here, but he noticed that they already had, like, a chief, you know? They were like, oh, this, this cacicazgo has a cacique. So he started making alliances with them in order to have it easier, you know, to, to have everybody to listen to them. Because, for example, he will say, oh, I come from the queen, here's my title. And they'll be like, and who are you? He was like, oh, you have to do what I say. And they were like, okay. But they didn't, some people, like, didn't really want to do what they did, what they said. So they thought, hmm, if I have an alliance with their cacique, that will be easier. You know, we can they can listen to me. So they created alliances. Remember that one of the type of alliances you could have was marriage. Yes. So basically what they did is that they start getting married between the conquerors and the daughters of the caciques. So they arranged this marriage and they were like, okay, so you will have people respecting you because you are now in charge because they recognize you because you're married to um, a daughter of the cacique. Sometimes they also didn't really marry with permis permission. You know, some, some conquerors were like, oh, I like that girl. You're my wife now. That also happened. That was not nice. It will never be okay. But it also happened. Okay? So what happened when they get married? Of course, um, they start having babies. But these babies, they were a mixture. And that also has to do with the word in Spanish, mestizo. It means like a mixture, you know. So you had somebody white who was a uh, white chapeton, and you have an indigenous woman. And when they had a baby, that baby will be known as mestizo. Because he was white, she was indigenous, but the baby was a mixture. So it's a mestizo. But the mestizos didn't have... Uh, all the rights as the white babies. So even, let's say, my brother is white because he was he came from Spain with my dad. And then my dad uh, had me with my mom, but I'm not white. As you can see, I'm not white. <laughs> so even though we're brothers, we're siblings, he will have more rights because he was white. And I will have to bring the food or to make his bed or to do other things because of my skin color. Because they meant I wasn't as important and he, as he was because of the skin color. So mestizos were these babies, again, between the mixture of the white and indígena. Mestizo. So mestizos, we're also going to place them in our Rolls Waterfall. Here we go. Rolls, Rolls, Rolls. So, Blanco Chapetón. Blanco Criollo. And the new ones. Mestizos. So I have my mestizos right here. The combination between indigenous and white. Mestizo. Now that we have the mestizos, we remember that I told you that they have made an alliance with the cacique. So they were, hey, I can marry your daughter and I could be in charge, but you could also be kind of in charge. So it's like they offer them uh, a place, of course, below them, you know, so we have Blanco Chapetón, Blanco Criollo, Mestizo, Cacique y Cacica. So they had a place on this hierarchy because of the alliance that they have made. And at the bottom, 
the bottom of the social hierarchy of this pyramid, you had the indigenous people and the black people. So they were the less important. Remember the, the, the symbol of the cake we used to have? So they will have the crumbs, like they were not important. And it's very interesting because we're going to learn what happened to those indigenous people and what happened with the black people because we didn't have black people. We were just indigenous. So where did the black people came from? <laughs> Some of you have the answer because when we went to the field trip to the museum, they told you. But don't tell me, don't tell me. <laughs> We're going to learn it in other classes. So for now, what you need to do is that you need to finish all you roll waterfall. Two, 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 rolls waterfall. And your individual work will be to record yourself showing your rolls waterfall. I'm going to show you. You're going to record yourself like this. Hello, Miss Eddie. This is my rolls waterfall. I am Tomas. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You don't talk like that. But you're going to say, these are the Rolls waterfall of the colonial age. Ah. First, we have the Blanco Chapetón, who were the people that came from Spain. Blanco Chapetón. Then we have the Blanco Criollo. The Blanco Criollo were the people that were born in America. Their parents were from Spain, but he was not born in Spain. He was born here. Do, 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 do. Then we have the mestizo. So the mestizo was a mixture between the white and the indigenous. Mestizo. Do, 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 do. The next one are the cacique and cacica, who were the ones that made an alliance with the Spanish to help them control the people. Two, 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 two. And the last one at the bottom of the pyramid, we have the indigenous and the black people that we're gonna see what they were supposed to do. And this was my Rolls Waterfall. Two, 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 two. Indigenous and black people. Ah, ah. Two, 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 cacique and cacica. Two, 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 mestizo. Two, 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 blanco criollo. Two, 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 blanco chapetón. Ah, rolls in the colonial age. Ah, bye, mi daddy. I love you, babies, so much. We have so many things to learn and it's so interesting. I hope you're enjoying. Remember, you can always write me. <laughs> love you so much. Bye, babies.